gorgeous with big beautiful blue eyes and I had a great time with her till she started about getting married and then I found another squeeze. But anyway, I was at her house one night and Jesse came by and I said, let's go jam. He said, well, let's go get my guitar, which happened to be at a &M Studios where he was in the middle of making an album with John Lennon and Phil Spector. So we walked into the studio in there with John Lennon and Phil Spector and a shitload of other people. And, you know, we got all, everybody's pouring vodka and, you know, toast the Almond Brothers, toast the South, this, that, and the other. And finally, John Lennon was just a gentleman. He was wonderful. But Phil Spector turned into the world's biggest asshole. I kid you not. And he's in jail right now for a good reason. So I finally stormed out of the studio, tried to kick the door open, and it was a pull door. I almost broke my leg. And, you, and then you ever try to rip open the recording studio door? Well, the door don't open, your arm falls off. So I got out in the hallway, and Jesse's wandering around, and I said, I'm gonna go back in there and kick that little guy's butt. And he said, no you ain't. I said, God, he's only this big. He said, yeah, do you see the guy in the corner? He's about 14 degrees belt, black belt, has about 40 guns and 800 knives on him, and if you touch Spectre, he will rip you apart. That's why that little shit talks that way. <laughs> so Jesse talked me into walking down the hall where we wandered into a, a studio where another good friend of mine by the name of Joni Mitchell was mixing a glorious album with Tom Scott and what started out to be a night of jamming that went to a night of horror turned into a glorious night of music. And now we leave the history and we move into the future and guys, the set is wrong. And y'all know that. This is a song, brand new song, written by Bruce the Master and it's called Out from the Center and it goes exactly like 